what is going on guys it's your boy back with some more order and peace mod we already did the fall of the republic on yavin and we already did the dark times on mustafar and now today we do the new order on the death star because i haven't really played death star in quite some time i think on the channel so yeah we're about to play some of this and yeah about to have some fun yeah for the empire long live the empire all right we got the rebels i mean the insurgents and the galactic empire our heroes all right look at let's look at the rebels real quick we got these cool oh that's a cool trooper not even gonna lie dude oh we got twi'lek we got a akbar a mon Cala specialist another guy okay so these are the, like the usual suspects right here that we've seen and a wookie warrior that's locked all right bet bet we got stormtroopers all right all the stormtrooper types they're actually clean Ooh, a clean stormtrooper commander okay all right bet bet all right let's start as the side of the rebels uh, let's be uh, the rebel soldier a rebel soldier oh dang we, we already lost the post hey you know what it is what it is because we do be the rebels though so as long as we're not the empire losing the battle <laughs> i'm playing i'm playing but yo all right speaking of rebels i'm actually in the process of actually watching Star always rebels i know right what who would have thought like I'm, i made it to season two and it's actually not as not as bad as i used to think it was i mean obviously it's no clone wars obviously but still like there's some pretty cool concepts going in con concepts in it that i wouldn't have never actually you know seen without actually like seeing it myself so all right, not bad, not bad. I'm actually, uh, I'm actually impressed at how lame it actually. I'm playing. Now nah, it's actually, it, like I said, it's not as good as Clone Wars, but it's not that bad for real, for real. Always, I was always like me on Star Wars Rebels for like a long time. Like the show Star Wars Rebels, I was like, dang, it's always like trash because it got canceled. Clone Wars got canceled for it, but realistically, it's actually not, the, not even that bad. Ooh, we got the Battlefront Two Leia skin. <laughs> I wonder if she has the, dang, she ain't got the freaking unpatched, you know what I mean, the unpatched peach from lit, <laughs> I, I have to mention it in the video, anyways, let's, um, let's get after this post here, dang, I thought we'd get, like, somebody like Skywalker, but Leia's, Leia's cool, I guess, I mean, I don't know, I kind of suck with Leia, like, default Leia, hey, her blaster's kind of accurate, though, that's pretty cool, invulnerability, thermal detonators, sorry, bet, 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 blow them up, capture the, capture their posts, we captured both hangars. Now they cannot escape, even though this is their space station. That means we can escape. Okay, that's cool. Sounds better. The rebels can escape. Now, if you're wondering why the reinforcements are so high, it's probably because, like, you know, I just added it that high just so the match could last significantly longer if we don't capture all these posts and get a victory anyway. So, there's that. Always. Oh my god. I forgot about that. Oh my god. Every time that happens, I always have to, like, react to it. I'm like, it's just crazy. Somebody literally just blows up. Like, bro, what? Like, he just blows up. Like, they just blow up. Like, just blam. Just blam. Okay, Ray 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 Lay is actually not that bad. I'm sorry, I'm just scratching my arms. Jeez. But yeah, actually, Lay is not that bad. I thought Lay was kind of like. Maybe, I just, maybe I'm maybe i doing a little better because of this camera angle. Who knows? I normally suck with Lay. Oh, sh shoot, bro. Shoot. Freaking officer is going crazy. Yeah, we're boxing him in. We're boxing. Oh, my arm kind of. My arm kind of. My arm feels spicy right now. Don't know why my arm feels spicy. Don't like that. I don't like that spicy feeling on my arm. Oh shoot, bro. See like, let's see that crap, bro. Is this even safe for video? I don't know. All right, don't kill me. I'm the princess. I'm the princess. Ah, oh, I'm out of grenades. All right, hold up, hold up. I figured. It's, I, wait. All right, so apparently there's like a glitch where you can like walk across. Oh hell no, nah, it's not. Bro, I thought I saw this glitch where you could like walk across that little beam, bro. That's crazy. I, I totally felt for that shit. <laughs> I remember seeing a video. It was like, oh yeah, you could like walk across that secretly. It's like a secret hidden, a hidden detail. All right, I'm the Twi Lake. I'm the Twi Lake. Um, boom, bucket head, bucket head, and bucket head. There we go. All right, let's jump. Oh, so yeah, you can do that. You can just do that. <laughs> it's not that deep, you know. Who would have thought? Let me try it from the other side. All right, let's see if I can sprint to it and, like, hope that they don't kill me. Don't kill me, don't kill me. Is it from this side? No, it's not from that side either. What the effing heck, bro? I thought it was, like, a glitch. Maybe that video was, like, a lie. <laughs> Maybe that, that might have been, like, a that might have been like a, a lie. Who knows? Why are there, like, why are there, like, cliffs even on the Death Star? That makes no sense. I guess they said natural selection would do his job. 
No guardrails, dude. Freaking, freaking. They would get sued, bro. The Death Star would get sued if this was real. <laughs> I'm not gonna have guardrails over cliffs, dude. That's insane. That would, they would get sued in real life if this was a real job. <laughs> oh man, and, and I wouldn't blame them. I'm like, bro, you telling me that you can't put guardrails in your own in your own station, bro? Like, imagine if like warehouses just didn't have like guardrails for certain things. It's just like, oh yeah, you could get hit, you could fall off a cliff, but hey, we don't really care. It work for us, right? For the Empire. Nah, not Leia. Not Leia. Not Leia. Um, I could just be somebody else. Let's be this guy. This guy's pretty badass. He looks pretty cool. The Rebel. He looks like the Rebel Vanguard from Classic Battlefront 1, of course. I have my Incinerator. Oh yeah, let's, let's give everybody buffs. Let's go. Fight back. Fight the Empire, like from Andor. That speech from Andor, fight the Empire. Uh, where's the name? Oh dang. I forgot that lady's name. But it's on that map. Was it Ferrix or something like that? From Andor. Dude, Andor is pretty goaded, not even gonna lie. Not even gonna cap with you. Of course we lost the post, bro. Man, bro. And this guy looks like a like a clone trooper. No stormtrooper armor, but it's like red and blue. Red and blue custom stormtrooper armor. It'd be like that. With some rebel blasters. A uh, grenade launcher, Granada. All right, come on, come on. Where they at though? Pew pew pew. They bombed him. See, this is how you can tell the rebels are are like, insurgents. They have like mortar launchers. They have like explosives. They do hit and run attack tactics, bro. Hit and run tactics. That's very uh, it's very not good. Why would you do hit and run tactics, bro? The rebels be like, yo. Disrupt Imperial supply lines. Any ways to piss off the Empire? It'd be like that though. Oh crap! I saw that. I saw that from the corner of my eye. Come on, can we take this for the rebels? Who says that? Says nobody ever. Yo, dudes, the Empire do be pretty chill though. Maybe we should like join it or something. Oh, they. Oh my God. So is the rebel? Is the rebel jet trooper? Holy crap! All right, let's do that again. But oh my God, <laughs> that's actually crazy. This is like the only place, the only spot I can actually use this jetpack, like, freely, and actually have, like, a good bit of space. This is a nice size hangar, actually. Like, this hangar is pretty big. I wonder what hangar number it is. Hangar A69 or some crap, dude. Hangar A69. Death Star has, like, thousands and thousands of hangars all around. Is the equator of the Death Star, like, the hottest point of the station, dude? Where it's like, damn, it's kind of hot here, because the equator of the Death Star. Who knows? Where's the North Pole of the Death Star? Does it have, like, a toy shop? What's all on the Death Star? All 500-something levels, 512 levels of the Death Star? Well, this is based off the first Death Star, so... I think the first Death Star is smaller than, like, 500 levels, but I don't even know. Or how big is the Death Star? Screw it. I don't even know. Let's be Wookiee Warrior! Wookiee Warrior and call it a day for these rebel insurgents on my Death Star. The enemy is in control of another command, post. Of another command post. Oh, no! Oh no! Oh, we're actually losing. <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention to the number because the number's so big. You know who really cares when the number's that big? You know what I mean? Now one day I'm actually going to like I'm gonna do like ten thousand versus ten thousand one day. I'm gonna do like ten thousand droids versus ten thousand clones. Just live stream myself just doing like one map. And <laughs> see, I'm I'm gonna deny the command post capture and like the fake console stuff. But um, I'm just gonna do like a big battle. What who, what battle should I do? If I do something like that, like ten thousand versus ten thousand. And I stay on one side the whole time. Maybe I do both sides for like a live stream. Who knows? But taking out like 10,000 10, clones, 10,000 droids as the clones, 10,000 clones as the droids. I know that somebody would like that. But yep, I'm about to switch sides real quick. <laughs> and just like that, I switch sides. I know I can just like press the button right here and it will do that. But that's not always the case sometimes. Sometimes it will glitch out and not do that. Let's start off as a stormtrooper. Since we have so many units, we can crush the rebels and surgeons. Oh yeah, and I forgot the rebels still have like the two, the losing two reinforcements at the same time. Glitch on here. I know Classic Collection actually patched that, but this ain't no Classic Collection. This is the real collection. I say the real collection. <laughs> but yeah, like every time you shoot a rebel unit, they're gonna lose like two reinforcements versus like just the one, you know? Like they're at uh, 2498, they lose one. Ooh, 94. Oh dang. Oh, we could be Tarkin. Oh, crap. We lost the entire map, though. 
Oh no, this could be bad for us. We lost the entire map. All right, so I can save us, Admiral. I mean, Grand Moff, Will Hoff, whatever the name is. Bro, why do you have the same weapon as Leia? Just worse. All right, shall, shall we take the hangar back? Uh, our reinforcements are thinning. I have a melee. Bro, Tarkin out here slapping rebels, dude. Slap them. Tarkin out here slapping the rebels, bro. Bro, I thought it was going to be like Vader or like the Emperor. I'm freaking Tarkin, dude. This is a new hope. New hope vibes. It'd be like that. All right, let's cap this back. This is ours. This is our station. Not the rebel station. We're losing reinforcements. Bro, the, re the freaking, not rebel. The Imperial announcer always reminded me of Tarkin. So what's Tarkin doing here? This is kind of like a paradox or something like that. Oh, they repaired the dam. They repaired it. All right, bet. The rebel's actually doing some good, I guess. Repairing our facilities. Now, why would they do that? That don't make no sense. All right, slap him. Slap him. Yeah. Oh, wait. Boom. Sit down. Slap him. <laughs> Tarkin out here is just slapping rebels. There ain't no way, bro. He said, fine. I'll do it myself. That's what Tarkin just said. All right, freaking headshot of Wookie. Nay, apparently Tarkin was like Tarkin was like shredded in like a comic. That was pretty cool. <laughs> There's like some canon comic, canon canon is it's canon I think where he's like shredded. So canonically, this is actually lore accurate right here. Lore accurate Tarkin fighting for the Death Star, incompetent. Wait, who's still shooting? What the? Oh, is that, is that freaking turret? I don't really care about that turret. They'll blow it up. All right, so we got three. Oh, they're capping something, bro. Hey, get off. Get off. I'm going to say, get these rebels out of here. I'm going to say, why, why was nobody defending this, though? This, nobody was defending this. We're letting the rebels just take our crap. I'm shooting this tweet like, and this tweet like, is, is, what? That's why this laser beam sucks, bro. I'm shooting this tweet like, and that tweet like did nothing. Oh, I got E11. I didn't even know that. Bro. Tarkin out here packing, packing that heat, slapping rebels. This is so funny, bro. Ain't no way Tarkin out here slapping rebels, bro. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Hold up. Got my damage increase. Damage increase. Come on. Use it. I can't even use it right now. That's some bull. Some bull crap. Can't even use my freaking damage increase, but I can't use this E11, though. So let's go. Long live the Empire. Long live the Death Star. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> oh, snap, Tarkin, bro. No, Tarkin, no. I haven't been any other trooper yet. All right, let's beat this guy. Wait, what? Wait, what? I know I selected this guy. Let me say, game, what are you trying to do? You're trying to, game's trying to sabotage. Sabotage. All right, blow him up. All right, screw it. Same here, bro. I want those rebels dead, too. Dang, I, I survived two incinerator incidents. Is there ammo or health droid? There's got to be a health droid, right? Hell yeah. Oh, I got this freaking big ass, big ass T twenty one B. All right, give me that. Give me, that, give me some stuff. I know you want to. All right, you can follow me though. This way, affirmative. All right, let's go save the empire. Let's go save the empire from these insurgents. Why is there like thousands of insurgents on our station right now? No. See, that's a friendly fire rocket. Oh crap. Okay, this thing does like hella damage though. See, I love this area. It's always like a hot spot. I like the hot spots. Oh, crap. Oh, they got me. They got me. Ah, ah. All right. Let's be a scout trooper. I mean, this won't make really, like, do well in here, I think. Um, Maybe do the auto turret, I guess. Throw my grenades. Spam grenades. Ah. Ah. No scope. No scope. Oh, shit. Oh, ooh, trick shot. Oh, never mind. Ha, <laughs> I have an E11 though. I saw that first look second. I had an E11. All right, let's be the engineer. All right, so this person's from Rogue One. What a phenomenal film, by the way. Rogue One is like the, easily like the best Disney Star Wars stuff. And it's been it's crazy because it's been like such a long time. Uh, no Tarkin. It's been out for like a long time. It's been a long time since they've done anything like that good, you know? Like movie wise, movie wise. I mean, Solo was pretty good though, but Rogue One is better than Solo in my opinion. But Solo's not bad. Solo's not bad. Rogue One is like the best Disney film that they ever did yet. So far. Ah, Yeah, I have nothing else to say about it. It's pretty base. I like it. Technically, Rogue One is a prequel. Imperial officers. Alright, Imperial officers are pretty cool. No, dude. I was just about to ask him to follow me and then this rebel. Rebel freaking marksman. 
or marks women. I don't know why they call it rebel marksman. Can't spell women without men. It can be true though. All right, shot troopers. Let's go. All right, rage boys. Follow me. I'm a good leader. Unlike, unlike most officers. Oh wait, never mind. Unlike most Imperial commanders, dude, I'm actually a really good leader. I I charge into battle. Now, would an actual officer like charge into battle like that? Probably not. It would most likely be the commander, if anything. All right, Imperial jump trooper. I mean, this don't make sense. And here, I get. I mean, in this room, I guess it only makes sense in this room. Let's try to flank. You know, let's be some do something smart. I'm gonna jump up there. Yeah, the Death Star. I know my way around the Death Star. I like these insurgents. Lost on so many like Twi'lex. I don't want that. I don't want to have to do this, but like, because the Twi'lex actually look good. But still, it's for the Empire. It's for the glory of the Empire. All right, this is the Tie Fighter hanger. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, get these rebels out of here. I wish you could board these. That'd be pretty badass. Yep, I'm taking this post. That way they can only have one command post left. They might actually take it. Who knows? Or we might actually nope. Or I'm not taking that post. I'm just Come gonna on, incinerate no and blow up instead. Oh crap! And they're taking the prison. Oh hell! Oh hell no! No 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 no! All right, let's be the shock trooper. Shock trooper with the heavy blasters. All right, so I have my E11 and this freaking heavy blaster rifle. Was it a T21B or T21? So this one with the scope. So the one with the scope is like T21B scoped or something. I don't know. I'm not fully sure. I don't, I'm not. I'm not sure on my imperial, my imperial arsenal weaponry or whatever. I'm not really up to par with that. I just remember stuff from Battlefront 2015. I tried to. Dude, Battlefront 2015 actually had like a great weapon variety though. I don't know what happened with like 2017 Battlefront 2. But like the Battlefront 2015 game, actually had really good weapon variety. If only it had Clone Wars, it would have even better. If only it had Clone Wars. If that game had Clone Wars, that weapon variety in 2015 would be close to like it. it like it would be like the best one of like all the Battlefront games for sure. But nope, they were like no, no Clone Wars, no. Let's be learned. All right. Oh wait. Oh wait. That's my dude. Freaking E11s go off, bro. I got a turret myself. All right. Yeah, no Tarkin. No Tarkin. Auto turrets. Do your job. Auto bots. Roll out. Oh, yes. I finally saw Transformers 1. Not bad. Not bad. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys are into that type stuff. I saw Transformers 1. Pretty good. I know I kind of just repeated myself there, but, you know, I'm just, you know, for the people in the back who probably didn't hear. All right. Let's go. Get the... Oh, no. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Oh darn, we lost the entire station, dude. Oh no. Commander, save us. We need we need some saving, Commander. We lost the entire station to these insurgents. Alright, let's go take back the laser. Alright, come on, follow me, boys. Follow me, imps. My troopers. My brothers. Fight my brothers. <laughs> my brothers. Aid us, my brothers. We will fight to, to save the Empire, my brothers. Imperial brothers. Imperial brethren. Let's go. Oh crap. No. No, 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 no. Oh. Our squad has been defeated. Alright, let's do that one more time. It's the Stormtrooper Commander, dude. Alright, let's make a new squad. New squad. Alright, you follow me. You follow me. Who else is gonna follow me? I don't know. Nobody has spawned in. Bruh. Alright, this is all I got. You know. Make do with what we got, guys. Beggars can't be choosers, they say. So let's go. Let's go. All right, let's save our station for the glory of the Empire. Long live the Empire. They just keep spawning in, dude. They just keep spawning in, dudes. We can't do anything when they keep spawning in. Sorry, Tarkin. Wookie. Wookie. Yeah, I don't want to be old man Tarkin, even though he is kind of base, though, in this mod. Tarkin is kind of base. It kind of reminds me of Leia, dude. Imagine they actually added Tarkin in the stock game. That'd be pretty cool. They could have added Tarkin in, like, 2017 Battlefront, bro. They're tweaking. I mean, they added all of those bounty hunters. Why did they add Tarkin in 2015 Battlefront? That would have been funny. Probably because he's like too old. Imagine for like Death Star instead of Chewbacca and and um instead of Chewbacca and Boss. Remember the Death Star DLC in 2015? Instead of Chewbacca and Boss, they added Tarkin and Ben Kenobi. That would be cool. We had another lightsaber person, and Tarkin would be. I mean, I don't know how that would match for Tarkin, but hey, he'd be a he'll be a good you know. I don't know. I feel like it would make sense. Two old guys, Tarkin and Ben Kenobi, for Death Star DLC and 
freaking Battlefront 2015. That would have been funny. It only makes sense. That game had the first Death Star, and 2017 Battlefront had the second Death Star. Damn. So I died so many times right here. All right, you guys. That's going to do it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new. Welcome to the channel if you guys are new. Also, happy birthday to whoever's birthday is out there watching. But yes, be sure to subscribe or else Tarkin and Lord Vader will not be pleased. But anyways, long live the Empire, guys. Take care.